Hello, everyone, and welcome to another Excel chat walkthrough video. I'm your host, Kevin Kelly, and today we're going to be talking about how to use the Excel standard deviation function. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So the standard deviation function is labeled DST DEVP. Uh, so DST develop, it kind of looks like. Um, and it's made up of three kind of main components, and that is the database the field and the criteria. And we'll talk a little bit more about that as we get into this Excel file. So the way that you typically want to have your data set up, uh, if you're working on a uh, standard deviation, you're going to solve for that formula. Uh, you're going to want your criteria here to be separate from your uh, database. So what we're going to do here is we're going to put our formula here and we'll say equals um, DST DEVP because that's the standard deviation formula. Now it's going to ask for our database. Now the database is just this entire uh, table. So think of it as just the table, right? So our database is our table. Now it's asking for a field. So what area of the table or the database do we want to focus on? So we're going to focus on average life expectancy, obviously, because that's the only thing that can even have standard deviation in this case. Now it's asking for our criteria. And our criteria is just going to be, we're looking at the average life expectancy, so the standard deviation of average life expectancy for the state of Texas. And that's how you want to think about these formulas. Hit enter, and the answer is three. So obviously this is an extremely small table, so I'm going to highlight what we're looking at here. We have two entries for Texas, uh, and it's 69 and 75. Six apart, standard deviation is three. Super easy, super simple. You and I could do that on a calculator. But when you have massive data tables uh, where you have to take a lot of other criteria uh, you know, in, in, into play here, this is a really helpful formula. Um, so... Again, just real quick, the components are database, which is this entire table, the field, which is this column right here, average life expectancy is what we're looking at. That's what we want the standard deviation of. And our criteria is the state of Texas. Still have questions? Click to get help from a live Excel expert at Excel Chat.